The pro-Brexit Tory MP mocked the top EU official for failing to understand the concept of democracy. Mr. Evans said poor Donald Tusk. When we talk about democracy, I really do appreciate why he doesn't fully understand it. He has never been elected to the presidency, like lots of other presidents. He's just been elected by the country's prime ministers and governments. Despite having served as prime minister of Poland for seven years, Mr. Tusk has since become a fierce Eurocrat calling for further integration among member states and has harshly criticized the Brexit vote. BBC Euronews Brexit News Nigel Evans claimed Donald Tusk could not understand the concept of democracy MR. Tusk recently said the European Union would be open to welcome the United Kingdom and would the fold should Britons have a change of heart. But Mr Evans claimed the Eurocrats' commitment to the European project makes him unable to understand the UK's democratic decision to leave the Brussels bloc. Speaking to the BBC, the Tory MP continued we understand exactly why he doesn't really understand the fact that we've had the biggest festival of democracy that this country has ever seen, which was the referendum in 2016. The British people had a very binary question, in or out, they decided out and now that's what we're going to deliver. Mr Evans' comments came after the EU withdrawal bill cleared the Commons after MPs voted to give it a third reading by 324 to 295. The Brexit bill is one of the key components of the British government's Brexit strategy is it would ensure legal continuity to the UK by transposing EU law to the British system. Brexit Secretary David Davis opened the debate on the bill's final stage of scrutiny before peers begin debating it in the House of Lords. He said, this bill is essential for preparing the country for the historic milestone of withdrawing from the European Union. It ensures that on day one well have a statute book that works, delivering the smooth and orderly exit desired by people and businesses across the United Kingdom, and being delivered by this government.